Hi everyone, it's Elaine from Orange Cloud and today I'll be showing you how to make these loot boxes inspired by the characters from the Clash of Clans. They're super cool looking and it's a great way to store your valuables. So stick around with me and let's get sassy with our hands. To make your loot box, you'll need a can of Pringles, masking tape, a pair of scissors, a palette, a container of water, and some paint for the face. I'm using cadmium red, carbon black, cerulean blue, and titanium white from New Art, and daffodil yellow by Crafters Acrylic. Some paint brushes like the ones that you see here. I'm using a flat brush, a round brush, and a small detailing brush. Some yellow foam paper and a glue gun. To start off, empty out the can of Pringles and give it a rinse. Now you're ready to cover it with masking tape. Start by taping from the top edge and continue to wrap the tape around until the entire can is covered. What you're doing is creating a blank canvas so that the paint can adhere to the can to create a seamless finish. Once you're done taping, it'll look something like this and now we're ready to move on to the barbarian's nose. We're going to roll the masking tape to create three balls and first we're going to rip about two inches of tape and we're going to scrunch it up into a ball and we're going to add more tape to make it larger and then after we're going to rip about half an inch of tape to form the nostrils and once you're done forming the nose we're going to glue it to the can using the yellow red and white paint combine the colors to make the skin color of the barbarian which is kind of like a tan complexion once you're done mixing the colors to get the right skin tone, you're going to apply it using thin, even brush strokes. And once that layer is dry, apply a second layer of paint. Once the paint job is done, it will look like this. Now we're going to move on to make the bridge of the nose using the same masking tape technique that we did for the ball of the nose. Rip off some tape and roll it and shape it into a square, like so. Afterwards, glue the bridge of the nose to the can. Then you're going to paint it. Now we're making the barbarian's hair and beard along with the lid out of the yellow foam paper. I have provided a template in the link below in the description box. After tracing the template, you're going to cut the pieces out. When you're done cutting, Glue the circle and rim pieces onto the lid. Now take the hair and glue it onto the can, keeping in mind to leave a 5mm gap from the top for the lid. Now you're ready to glue the beard onto the can. And we're pretty much done the major components. Now I'm going to pencil in the eyes and the teeth and I'm going to glue in the ears for the extra detailing. Using the white paint, paint in the eyes and teeth. Now we're going to add in the blue eyes and the pupil and using the black paint I'm going to outline the teeth and the shape of the mouth, but if you don't want to do this, you could always use a black fine tip marker as well too. And there you have it. Now your loot box is all done and it's ready to keep all your loot safe. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button or that cute little cloud at the corner. Like it or leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Until next time, stay sassy.